Hurts two in scoring position for the Wildcats who have been shut out by three or shut out through the first three by Chaffin. But Kentucky has had numerous base runners. Peterson gobbles it up but has no play. Peterson by keeping it on the infield saved a run but she had no chance to get the very swift Riley Smith who is now three for three with an RBI. Johnson is on deck. The pitch rammed into right center field. Koffel rounds third. She will score. We've got a one-run ball game. The throw to second base is not in time. Back-to-back -back doubles to open the top of the seventh inning. Harrison came in at first base last inning. Ground ball up the middle. It is beyond. The pitcher and the shortstop, Miko Harrison, slides in at second. She's safe there, and the Wildcats have done it again as they continue to come back from deficits. Miko Harrison. Erupted for three here in the seventh. Ground ball stabbed by Sinceri and then drops it, and another run scores. Sinceri had plenty of time to make the play and then reached into her glove and just dropped the ball. The 3-2 pitch again. She struck her out. Spangler gets Rudity to end the game. And for the third straight outing, the Kentucky Wildcats have come from a deficit to claim a victory. Kind of an unbelievable series here. You got to give all the credit to Kentucky. There is no quit in this Wildcat team. The Wildcats.